Good morning! It's the 1st of November and it's also the first day of a longitudinal clinical experience. So basically what I'm doing is I'll be going to a family medicine clinic and I'll be able to shadow a family physician and also be able to practice taking histories, talking to patients, and practicing all the skills I've been learning so far in the past two months in medical school. So right now I'm just heading out and getting ready to get to the family medicine clinic that I'll be doing my LCE at. All right guys, catch up with you later. So we just got here to the hospital and now I'll be walking in to find the family medicine clinic where I'll be doing my LCA experience and I'm really excited to meet my preceptor and see patients. Okay, so I just went through the main entrance of the hospital where the family medicine clinic is supposed to be located. But it turns out the building I need to get to is on the other side of the hospital. So here I am walking around and probably getting lost. Stay tuned. So this is the office where I'll be doing my LCE, my longitudinal clinical experience. And it's pretty nice because I've got my own little desk, I've got my computer. It's very comfy in here. Hello, so we just saw quite a few patients in the last two hours or so. We're just taking a break. I think we'll be doing a virtual patient afterwards, but it's been a lot of fun. I've been managing to apply the concepts I've learned in class, and yeah. So I just finished my shift for my first ever longitudinal clinical experience and honestly, it was a lot of fun. I got to try a couple of different things on the patients that I got to practice. Honestly, I think I need to work on my otoscope skills more because I'm not very good with that. I'm always really concerned about making the patient feel uncomfortable when I put in the otoscope in their ear. But I got to do some physicals. I got to do some history taking, not a full one, still need to practice that. But all in all, it was a great experience. I definitely learned a lot. And my preceptor, as well as the resident here, was very supportive. And they had a lot of knowledge and expertise. And I'm looking forward to my next LCE. walking towards the bus stop but as you can see there's a ton of construction in this area so I do see a bus stop up ahead hopefully that's the right bus stop that I need to take to get back to university because I need to take the number four and it looks like a bus stop fingers crossed on a bus coming So here I am waiting at the bus stop. It's pretty chilly out. Apparently it's about 2 degrees Celsius. At least it hasn't snowed yet because we do get lots of snow here in Edmonton. And I think my bus isn't coming until 20 minutes later so I might as well just talk about how things went today. I definitely need to work on my otoscope skills. I don't think I'm very good with it yet. And hopefully I get more chances to practice that down the road. And it's kind of windy right now actually, so hopefully the weather gets a bit better maybe over the weekend, but highly doubt it because winter is coming in Edmonton. 
But yeah, no, it went really well, and I'm heading back to university now, so hopefully the bus comes soon. <laughs>